Greetings, YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. You know, I like this uh, non-glasses look, but I think the blue glasses are sort of a staple at this point. Um, it's funny to me because we're starting with a message about uh, Hero Crystal Daily Cards available now. Valiant Daily Card. 40 bucks. We know Valiant Crystals are not really going to give you seven stars. Uh, the seven star Nexus is kind of the, um, obviously the, the, the golden carrot, but it's a 0.5% drop rate. So not going to happen for most people. 2,500 Titan Crystal Shards is small. I think this is why the game is dying. It's dying because the guaranteed odds of offers like this continue to go down. And look, I'm not saying that the game doesn't have life. I still think there are plenty of people who are spending. There are plenty of people who are playing. It would be false and weird of me to think otherwise. But just as I turn my light on to get some more light in this video. There we go. It's also worth noting that this is not where I thought the game would be at this point. It's really good that we don't have eight stars. Like, that's, that's good. But seven stars shouldn't be this impossible for this amount of money. It, they just shouldn't. And I keep looking at offers like this and I just keep thinking, where is the value? If it was a Valiant Nexus, I could maybe see it. But one per day, you're likely going to get a five star day. If you open 30... Statistically speaking, you're going to get 20 to 25 five stars. The six star heroes and the six star nexus, for people who are valiant, are also going to do almost no good whatsoever, unless there's a specific champion that you're targeting. But it just feels stale. It's offers like this that make me think the game is dying because it just doesn't seem like it's refreshing at all. It's dragging um, the game backwards into a time where I was doing breakdown videos and discussing whether or not something was worth anything because there was no guaranteed value. And we've come a long way since then. On my free-to-play account, I also did an offer video this weekend where I praised Kabam for the six-star price for uncollected players who got access to the Cavalier offer, by the way, and Tier 5 Class Catalyst Selectors. That kind of thing should be involved for Valiant players, but I just don't see it. I don't see it because I think Kabam is afraid to move the game forward. I think Kabam is afraid to move the game forward because they don't want the backlash of 8 stars, and we certainly don't want that either. But it's, it's got to be better than this. Because as long as we're looking at offers like this for 40 bucks, the Titan Crystal Shards... You could easily open Titan Crystals. I mean, I did commentaries where on July 4th we had players open 10 Titan Crystals with Titan Nexus, and they still didn't get amazing value. So you can get a Titan Nexus and still be disappointed. So 2,500 Titan Crystal Shards. Maybe the Titan Crystal was 10,000 Shards, but it's 20,000, right? All in all, it's just... It's just weird. It's weird that people are coming up with these offers. It's weird that this exists. And I can't help but be very disappointed by it all. And that's all I have to say about that. I mean, for 40 bucks, I'd give this offer maybe a D. And that's pretty generous.